There are a lot of reasons why the Ducks have gotten off to such a good start. Obviously, the coaching staff's been able to recruit better players in recent years, and those athletes have more ability to do more things during the course of a game. But oftentimes, the winning edge is not physical, but mental, and that's where Karen Nelson has helped. Nelson is a former high school coach who is also the mother of Duck freshman quarterback Bobby Brothers. She's been around athletics most of her life and for the past four seasons as a sports psychologist has helped the Ducks on the mental approach to the game. They've shown through research that between 70 to 90 percent of your performance has to do with your mental skills once the physical skills are learned and mastered. So that would be, you know, your attitude, how you feel, um, the things you think about, your beliefs in, in your skill level. And then there's ones of you in here that automatically just have that, that sense of, I am really good. If all I need is the time, maybe the time to learn the new system, the time to get a little bit stronger, but I'm good. And that's the kind of attitude that you need to develop. Nelson points to punter Ted Milburn as one of her star pupils. It's not like any other position where you're surrounded by other players out there, and in that given moment, um, you're pretty alone. Other than the ball being snapped to you, you know, you're pretty alone, and it's very visual if your punt is good or not good. <laughs> I think she's done a lot for a lot of people, and at times when I didn't want to talk to anybody or just crawl up, she's she's really come out and put forth so, uh, an effort that really touches touches in a good spot with me. Makes me feel good. During a game or in everyday life, there are a myriad of highs and lows. Nelson's tried to help the team handle those tough situations. Do you get really angry when you make a mistake and you know kick yourself around the field and and you dwell on it and um, you throw your helmet? and you reinforce that negative thing that just happened to you when you drop the pass you just you know you go over that and over that in your mind or do you just figure that that's past that's out that's gone it's in the past there's not a thing i can do about history and refocus on what you can do the next moment um it's real funny i'll see that and then about two years later when they're out on the field and they're maybe in a performance slump or they've dropped a pass or um, something has happened to them. Maybe they're, they're moved up and then they just fall apart, you know, moved up on the um, depth chart and they just fall apart. They usually call and say, you know, I'm really having some problems. Can I talk with you about it? As the old saying goes, you win some and you lose some. In recent years, the Ducks have done a lot more winning than losing. And a lot of the credit has to go to Karen Nelson. We'll go back down to Jack Murphy Stadium for the second half of tonight's game against San Diego State in just a moment.